Hmm. Someone's behind schedule. It's fine. Doesn't matter to me. Well, it's just making an observation. That's all. It's not like you missed anything important. Hmm. Come sit over here. You won't be able to see if you stand so far back. I don't know. It'll take however long it takes. Curse users aren't predictable. Wherever they are, it's pretty far away. I haven't sensed any cursed energy entering the area yet. Mm, except yours. Listen, are you well enough to be on the job right now? That's a nasty cough you got there. You can just go home, you know. I won't say anything. I don't even know why those geezers assigned us both to this mission. It's probably so you can babysit me, which I think is even more reason to take the night off. It's not like you being here is going to change anything I decide to do. So, uh, yeah. If you want to go, go. Eh, your funeral. Uh, sit uh, somewhere other than the ledge, at least. The last thing we need is you fainting off the side of the building. Okay, seriously. What is going on with you? You've got nothing to gain by putting yourself through this. If you can't do it, you can't do it. Don't make a fool of yourself just to spite me. Know your limits. This isn't worth it. Why are you getting mad at me? <laughs> My fault? For what? Making you feel bad? I'm allowed to be straightforward with you. I don't mean to be patronizing either. I'm only trying to make you see how ridiculous this is. Wouldn't you prefer it if I... Oh, what? Ignored how sick you are? You are. And I know you're well aware of it too. What are you trying to prove with this? If you don't want to talk about it, then go home. Huh? What kind of question is that? Of course I care. If I didn't, I wouldn't have said anything at all. That... That situation is different. It's not that I didn't care, I... I just... I got busy. And had a lot less time to hang around after assignments. That doesn't mean I stopped caring about you. People drift apart sometimes. There's not always a good reason for it. <sighs> Okay, I guess I can see how you got that impression. Look, it's complicated. There's no point in going into all of that now. I didn't think that my decision to pull away would matter so much to you. When I started acting cold, you did the same. I figured you weren't all that affected. <laughs> Alright, yeah, yeah, yeah. I fucked up and I'm sorry. 
and you can get as mad as you want later. But right now, try to take it easy. That cough is a lot worse than I thought. Don't agitate your throat any more than you already have. Oh, shit. I think you need to see Shonko. Like right now. I've seen enough movies to know that when someone hacks up blood, it's never a good sign. Well, what'd she say when you talked to her this morning? I don't understand why you're being so cagey. <sighs> right. You're right. You don't owe me any answers. Just... Please, at least let me bring you back to Jujutsu High. The mission isn't that important. <laughs> it's nothing I can't do on my own. <sighs> What's that look for? Oh, come on. Those old fossils should be wary of you, not the other way around. I promise that you won't get any grief from them. Not if I have anything to say about it. <laughs> and you know I will. Of course I'd have your back. That's what friends are for, right? I thought that'd make you feel better. We need to get moving. Here, let's get you back on your feet again. What's wrong? What's hurting? Everywhere. Okay, here. I'll ease you back down. Shit. I can't warp you if I can't move you. Did you get, I don't know, poisoned or something? How did it get so bad so fast? Hmm. Could it be the effect of a curse that's avoided my detection somehow? Give me ten seconds. I'm gonna find the source of whatever this is and put an end to it. Why not? You're not making sense. And... Have you been eating flowers? Where did you even get these? Did Shonko tell you they help? Look, I'll stop asking so many questions once you tell me what's going on. You're keeping important information from me and I don't understand why. If it's something gross or shameful, I don't care. I'd rather you be embarrassed than dead. Oh. I see. That's... That's a big word. I... I still don't quite get it. Okay, you have feelings for me, and so what? You poisoned yourself? Romeo and Juliet style? Because that's harsh. Come on, I'm not that insufferable, am I? Sorry, I don't really know what to say. Jeez, how many of those flowers did you eat? They're getting everywhere. Maybe I can... <sighs> what does not look like I'm doing? <sighs> I'm trying to clean you off. Why? Does it hurt? Now be more gentle. 
These are... forget-me-nots. <laughs> what? Surprise I recognize them? They're one of the easiest flowers to... <laughs> well... not forget. And? There was a time you mentioned how they reminded you of me. My eyes. Yeah, I remember that too. So, is all of this happening because you have the hots for me? I am. I am taking this seriously. Just... <sighs> Give me a second, okay? I need to think about the right way to say this. I'm sorry. And I'm scared. But mostly sorry. Hold on a sec. Let me finish. I'm sorry because I'm supposed to be better than this. I'm supposed to be perfect at everything I do. When it comes to people who get close to me. People like you. I only managed to screw everything up. You'd think I'd learned the lesson by now. That the distance I keep between others is as much of a curse as it is a blessing. But... No. I've always found it easier to run. I thought that if I could be fast enough... Maybe my mistakes wouldn't ever catch up to me. You can see how well that's worked out. No. I don't mean that I regret getting close to you. Far from it. My mistake was pulling away. I just... I started to feel something when I was with you. Something that I haven't felt in nearly ten years. And it scared me to death. So, I did what I do best. And I shut you out. It was stupid and, and immature. And in the end, it didn't even work out. Because I... I still... I still have those feelings. As much as I'm capable of having them, anyway. <laughs> Which never seems like enough. I wish we could have talked through this at a better time. Under better circumstances. I'm really sorry that I let it get this bad. And I understand if you need time to process everything. I know I do. <laughs> Feeling any better now? Yeah, I do too. The color is returning to your face bit by bit. <laughs> I don't think I've ever felt more relieved. Hmm? Sweetheart, I meant every word. I don't think the curse would have broken if I lied to you. <sighs> Besides, you deserve the truth after all I put you through. No, really. This isn't just something I can apologize away. But, there will be plenty of time for me to make it up to you later. Do you think it'll still hurt if I try to stand you up? Alright, we can try. As long as it won't make anything else worse. Okay, you got it. 
Hold on to me. <laughs> Relax. I've got you. I've got you. I'm taking you to Shoko. Everything will be alright. And I'll be by your side the whole time. I won't ever leave you behind like that again. I promise. Hi there, sweetheart. Do you miss me already? Well, I've got a couple ways that you can fix that if you're interested. Why don't you subscribe to our channel, yeah? That way you'll know right away whenever a new video comes out. And for our lovely adult listeners, you can find a bunch of exclusive audios at patreon.com slash anagomi. If you like something more specific to your tastes, you should totally take a peek at anagomi.com slash commissions. Treat yourself to something sweet if you like. Well, till we meet again.